Hey guys, this is Jonas from Prime Tech, and today I'm going to be making a tutorial for Photoshop. This is going to be how to make a YouTube banner like this one, and these look really cool. So let's get started. Basically, what you need to do is go into Photoshop, click File New, make sure to set your pixels to 2120, and then 1192, and just make sure that the background is white, and click OK. And um, create that and then you have to make another one which has 2120 height or width 2120 width and 350 height and make sure this is black there you go okay so now that you have this you're gonna go to filter filter gallery grain intensity around 35 and contrast around 60 and then press ok this adds a little bit of grain to it so it blends in a little bit better so the next thing you want to do is grab a picture. I'm going to use this one right here. Put this into Photoshop and you're going to want to resize this. This is for the text, so get it the way that you want it. Press enter and then you're going to go over to that layer, right click and then click rasterize layer. Now what you want to do is go to your text tool. Make sure you have white text. Click anywhere and add your name. I'm going to do prime tech and then go back to your movement tool and then move this wherever you want it you can also click control T and you can resize it a little bit to make it bigger and then just press enter all right so now that you're ready to get your um, text ready you need to go to magic wand tool hold down shift and click on every letter of your text after you've done this click on your background layer and click control X then hide the text layer and delete the galaxy layer and then cl click control V or paste and now you'll have your now you have your text with the background in it now what you want to do is get a layer uh, like this I will show you guys how to do this in a different video make a PNG out of it but you want to take this and move it into this layer drop it and then position it wherever you want and then move your text to where it's around it and then once you're done with that you want to get another background so I'm gonna use this one right here this in the background of everything you want to make sure that this layer is under the text and rasterize that layer as well whenever you get done with that you can also go to adjustments up here go to curves and click layer below oops this is not right put it right there make sure that it's the layer below is the text layer and then you can adjust these curves to make the text brighter and darker so it's more visible so I'm gonna go about there all right now once you're done with that you want to right click any on any of these but wait actually you can, uh, once you're done with that you can reappear make this uh, text reappear and you can also if you want to oops sorry move that if you want to you can take this layer and line it up put it under the text layer and line it up behind it so it looks kinda cool like that and you can also make this layer uh, black just get a black paint bucket and make it black so it looks like it's cut out of it and you can just do that and it makes it look pretty cool so I'm gonna go I'm gonna do that now once you're done with that you wanna right click on any of these layers and click merge visible right here this will all this will merge it all together into one layer and then you're going to take this and move it onto your white background and then center it and get it all lined up so now you have that you want to select another background i uh, will just use this one you want to put this in size it press enter and rasterize this layer and then also move this under the these layers now once you've done that you can 
also do other layers like if you want to do one of these just put that on there click enter rasterize it and then to make it so it's kind of transparent go to normal where it says normal right here and click exclusion and then you'll kind of be able to see the other layer through it and then you can just move it around and size it up so you can do this with a bunch of the layers basically just to add stuff to it let's try it with this one so if I put this in here size it and then press enter rasterize the layer and click exclusion it'll make it look really cool like that so that's basically how you make your banner if you guys and you guys can spend a lot of time on this just trying uh, different things and you can also get different backgrounds to make it look cooler and stuff like that you can add different um, characters and animals and stuff in I'll show you some of the other ones I've got I've got this like chicken uh, diamond I'll put links where you can get these down below there's Will Smith and uh, yeah so just look online for galaxy pictures and stuff like that and also I'll put a link down below to a video where I show you how to make a transparent PNG background so you can do that as well so that's pretty much how you make a background like this um, once you're done with this just click merge visible and there you go there's your there's your banner so that's pretty much how you do it you can uh, put this into your YouTube and make it look really cool so guys I want you guys to spend a lot of time on this not just throw it together it makes it really really bad if you just throw it together actually spend time on this and make it make it a quality piece of work so that's pretty much it guys hope you guys enjoyed if this helped make sure to leave a like also comment down below some ideas for videos and subscribe for more videos like this and i'll see you guys later peace hey guys before you go i just wanted to tell you to go click the straw poll link in the description and vote for my new channel name i will be changing it so i want you guys to vote for that and i'll see what you guys say and i'll probably change it to that so guys thanks again and uh make sure to keep watching my videos peace